I hope you're excited as I am about Steemit and I've only been able to cover the tip of the iceberg uh, when it comes to Steemit. So if you have uh, any other questions about it, I highly recommend you go to their FAQ section or Frequently Asked Questions section on their website. I'm not sure if you could access it if you don't have an account, um, but you know, go there and they have a lot of information. Uh, but for now, let's talk about how to be successful on Steemit. And it's just like any other business you know you have to be persistent persistent and try to add value okay try to learn as much as you can to about the platform and when you first get started comment on other people's posts so people can start becoming aware of you and if you can try to post every day uh, because this is one thing that I've noticed about people who are making a living on steam it people who have been able to quit their jobs and what they do is they just post every day and are consistent consistent so you should try to be consistent on this network if you would like to be successful on it okay and try to post high quality content okay and try to be yourself and put a lot of effort also into your introductory video I noticed that a lot of people do not have introductory videos on Steemit but it's something that you should make uh, because people are always looking for new people on Steemit and there's what you call whales. Whales are what you call people who have big Steemit accounts and they're always looking for new people and they'll even upvote you if they like your post and give you lots of Steam dollars uh, because you know they'll want you to stay on the network. Okay, You should also know who your target audience is and try to make a connection with people don't just ask people to follow you don't say hey I'll follow you if you follow me okay and as you make more friends you'll have more people upvoting your posts which will translate into more money okay and lastly you should if you can invest into some steam tokens with your own money so then you'll have a vested interest in the value of the company to go up and your perspective will change and you'll post more high quality content it's almost like when you have shares in a company you're gonna have a vested interest in the value of that company going up 